I don't remember going in here though. Sound the alarm. Don't worry, there's no one left to sound the alarm to. Everybody is dead, Dave. So, hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to Let's Play Starfield. We are still in this, uh, where is it? Like, abandoned watchtower? Abandoned research tower. Partially explored, 50% complete. There were 3,000 credits in that safe so i will take them with great joy and at the same time hey. let's trade gear and i will offload my crap to sarah okay with that done it is time to proceed uh that oh another lock here okay i offloaded to sarah and found another advanced lock door so we we'll, went through that one Around that, we get a refund of our digi pick. Um, and not a lot else by the looks of it. Violet and Heartbreaker, and there is one of those uh, hockey sticks, and that's about it. Oh, there's a bit of food there. We'll take that, might actually turn out to be useful. Uh, Let's open the door. Okay, there's clearly some work been going on in these bathrooms. Okay, so are there any more up here? I mean, I didn't. Oh, oh, not again! Really, not the bloody alarm again! Can you leave the alarm out of this? I am bored of the freaking alarm. Okay, at least they didn't get the alarm. Where is he? He's... Oh, hello. Hello, I didn't see you there, fella. Ah, oh, bloody alarm is off again. I am sick to death of this goddamn alarm. Right. Uh, let's take that amp. <laughs> bloody amp. I want med, meds, not thing. Okay, hang on, computer. What can you do for me? Door status, open the doors. And permanently use 15% oxygen while moving when over encumbered. I will take that, because along with the bloody suit I was wearing, that is going to be top notch. Um, okay, what about this one? Door status, open, okay. Oh, hello. Sorry, missed you over there. I only have one bullet left. I shot her in the head, though. There you go. Unfortunately, I did just accidentally blow this up. Which was my bad. Come on. Got a present for ya. Yeah, who's throwing the grenade? You or them? Okay, I might have to run through the bloody fire there. Oh, bit of physics going on there as well. Sample vault. Interesting. Is there a way to disable that bloody gas? Um, what's up here? I hear the alarm more up here, as if there's a pull switch to switch the alarm. But I can't see it and we'll have a quick look out there I'm gonna have a quick look at what's out here because this is obviously an airlock as it's called airlock but um, I do want to check what's out here this looks like the roof okay whoa there's a different entrance here That's right. you, better run. you what where the hell are you? Oh, something's easy picking. Are, you, are they guys, those guys below me? Holy crap! They're throwing grenades at me. How are they throwing freaking grenades at me? They're down inside there. Okay. 
There are various areas here I have definitely not been. I will take your zero wire and your gimbal, and I will take, well, probably not your soda, I don't really care for your soda. But there's a few bits out here, a few areas you can walk down. This, see, look, I, I've clearly been here. But there is no way in here. So this actually was just the roof. Anything up here, high up on the roof? You might as well check, they sometimes hide things, you never know. The answer to that was a resounding no, but I found something else next to this enormous freaking gun, or whatever it is. Okay, light particle, doobie freaking digi pick. And... Meal pack, okay. Hmm. Okay. Not a lot of interest around here. Okay, and that takes us back to an air vent. Which might be the air vent we went past originally. And we can go back round to the door if we want to. Let's check out the air vent. Just because apparently there's Synapse Alpha in there. And where was this? I know where we are. This is where I found a whole bunch of credits. Can we turn the alarm off then? That would be great. Thanks. That is much improved. So yeah, we went down here anyway. We went out down around this way. Okay. So here we are, back roughly where we were. Unfortunately, I've still got to run through this fire, which is not something I wanted to do. I did just leg it through. We'll be fine, Sarah. Just just run quickly past and your suit can handle it. And then we can pick up what these Don't guys have. Any of that behind. There was another Diego uh, Diego or whatever he's called, Delgato. There was another Delgato thing, but I think it was the same one because it's not gone into like new stuff. So it's probably the same the same note. A potato. Okay. And someone dead down here. I remember killing them. Berserker shotty. Okay, then we've got a whole bunch of gear from this. Uh, yes, I will take that and we'll take the drinking water. And some more guys here. Oh, don't fall off the edge. I want to get up to that. That looks like a pack for people who have booster or something like that. People who, oh, I was thinking a reward for people willing to make the effort. And you know what it was? Bloody magnet. That was it. That was disappointing. Okay. Not a lot else here. Aside from a large block of ice. Okay, grab those bits. Anything else? I mean, there's a robot here. Any chance I can uh, get you on my side? Temporarily? Uh, update friend foe status. Recalibrate friend foe status. Yep, good, good. And activate the unit. Thank you. Thank you. You are now on my side. Glad to have you aboard. Okay, this looks like where we actually came up. And the sample vault is right here. Credits? Hello. I think I found something here. Do you think so? A planetary data console and this thing. A space adept Opsium dagger. Or Os Osmium dagger, sorry. Okay, sounds interesting. Titanium benzene. Lovely. Sealant. And that kind of looks like it's full of useful things, but I doubt it. I doubt that it really is. Yeah. 
just vials and stuff like that. Nothing of particular use. Okay, let's have a look at this. Planetary Data Console. Download and collect planetary data. Okay, that was, that was nice. Is that like a free survey? Is that like my... Yeah, that's like survey somewhat complete. I've completed the natural geological study, so... Is that quest complete? I mean, we've got... Find news stories for... And I'm not really interested in that. Apply for a job, rough landings. Where is the one we took from? Okay, we've killed the captain in the abandoned tower on Tau Ceti. He's dead. We've done it. We've done it. And we even have a robot guarding the place now. I don't remember going in here though. Sound the alarm. Don't worry, there's no one left to sound the alarm to. Everybody is dead, Dave. Oh god. I forgot to reload. Oh. Okay. Don't worry. Don't worry, robot. We think we've got it under control. There's one more guy here. Don't worry, you engage the enemy. I will engage the enemy too. Hello. Ow, that really hurt. Are you shoot me with a freaking shotgun or something? That hurt. Wow, I need a, a larger clip on this thing. Okay, the guy turned the pigging alarm on again. Where did he go? Where, where's the bloody alarm? Ah, quack, quack. I'm sure it was, must be around here somewhere. Yeah, there it is. Ah, better. Right. Calibrated trucker spacesuit. Trauma pack. Might need something along those lines fairly soon. As that kind of hurt. Right, lock pick. And what do we got? Modified drumbeat. Modified calibrated the coachman. Is run by the military. They're not going to let us tour the place without an escort. Sorry? Well, it's not exactly run by the military, it's full of bloody pirates. Oh, credits. I will take your credits. Okay, so. You were dead, Dave. Robot here to help, that's fine. Everything's good. Let's just have a quick scooter boot here. See if there's anything worth taking. Uh, yes, I'll take that. So I'm pretty sure we've cleared the place now. Um, and I've missed that zero wire right there. So if we'll just hit this, if we use this, there was one thing I needed tetrafluorides for. Um, actually, I think it was a pharmaceutical jobby. Yes, this one. There you go. Yes, I will confirm the touch through right. I can now make performance and enhancing things mark two. Okie dokie. There you go. Beautiful. Now. Hmm. I will take a bit of a poodle about just to check I haven't missed anything here. Because there's a few places like this I haven't been. I mean, I'm expecting only minor loot out of this. Fairly reasonable space helmet, mind. Um, you see, security uniform can sometimes be helpful. Okay, so I decided to have a little bit of a run around outside as I had most of the survey data. Um, and I've managed to pick up, what was it, four out of the five resources, frustratingly and uh, can't seem to find the other one so i am gonna head over to that natural occurrence over there to see because quite often they have it otherwise you might be looking at things like caves 
but we'll pick up on things like that along the way which definitely seem to have something storage crate um, some credits excellent but we're looking for I think it's cesium is what we're actually looking for but yeah, I'll head over to that natural occurrence. Typically that would have the trait that I already have, but um, it'll be fine. We'll just keep the scanner out and hopefully I will bump into some cesium along the way. Okay, so it's a cave, which is actually a good sign because that normally means that um, you are likely to run into things like cesium in a cave. Apart from the fact this cave looks horrific. Um, which is slightly less enjoyable. The cave looks like something out of Alien. And it's got a very sort of squishy organic sound to it, which is not is not doing it for me either, I've got to be honest. Yeah. Is it me or do I get the impression people died here? I mean, this is, this is weirdness. Okay, a control rod. Hazmat suit, fair enough. Can't blame you. I mean, normally there's more to a cave than this. Is this... This doesn't seem like the actual cave, because normally you have to go inside the cave. As in, it's actually a zone thing. And there's nothing here to scan. Which is also normally not the case. Look at this. That is a skull that makes me think like the big baby alien thing from Alien. Is it Alien 3 or 4? Or whatever it was. I mean, I am not keen. Right, let's see if I can find the actual cave entrance. I mean, it is marking this as the cave entrance. Um. But I'm going to have a look around anyway and see if there's something more here I'm missing. Well, despite that cave being horrific, I didn't find much of interest there. Instead, I'm heading over to this life science and seeing if that's going to give me anything. I mean, I'm fairly sure that this is the trait bit, but I'm just really hoping to bump into some cesium. Otherwise, I'll have to like fly to a different biome, which is really quite upsetting just to um, just to finish this off. A coral pond or a coral pond, however you want to pronounce it, or coral pond, the pond of carls. Um, normally, normally around here, there's things like rock piles and stuff like that that you can um get some resources out of, but I haven't seen any. I mean, it's definitely alive. But yeah, I've not seen any rock piles here. Aha! Look, this is actually really nice, because this is something I've just happened across. I was heading out in this direction, and this is cesium, which is a legendary resource. That is just out here ready to be actually mined and you can scan these like this and the survey is complete and there we go that's quite a big little cesium pile right there so that's kind of cool there was another cave over here but i think it was quite a way away so i don't think i can be bothered with it now i can head back to the ship i mean i'm not even fully overloaded so I can actually just fast travel and we'll get on with finding who I will now be lovingly calling Adria okay so we've got it actually flashed up as we arrived in orbit there it's kind of giving the game away a little because it did say um, what was it it said, find Andrea, find the artifact on Tau Seti 2. So whether we find her 
or not, it sounds like the artifact is here. And it sounds like we're going to this abandoned mine right here. Yes. Moving swiftly on. Um, okay, I will just sort inventory a second before we head out. And I will offload Sarah as well. Okay, and we're ready to go. I am a little bit intrigued and also terrified that Sarah has decided to help herself to using the shrapnel mine. Uh, the shrapnel grenades. Are you coming, Sarah? Are you staying here? Um, but I guess it's fine. Um, we've located the abandoned Starting mine. Starting a mining operation like this takes time, patience, and a hell of a lot of credits. It does. But to be fair, I've got quite a few credits, and oh god, here we go again. I should really watch out for mines. Sarah? Sarah? <clears throat> okay. In fact, this POI is kind of a recycled one. I've actually seen this one before. It didn't have the mines, but I've definitely seen this POI before. So this is certainly my second time around this particular POI. So if I remember, it's quite big in there, not so big in this little section. We will go up here. I should really watch out for mines. Maybe this is why I, I what? Excuse me. Do you, want, do you want to just watch out for that one right there? Not going to last much longer. Yeah, that's kind of hot, no? And I even set myself on fire when I came through it afterwards. But I do like the fact these things give you hydrogen. Um, I don't... Helium, sorry. Don't actually need much helium. I've got, I've, I've got helium coming out of my ears in all technicalities. But, um, you know... This is quite an interesting little planet. I didn't scan it from orbit like a Muppet. Um, so we didn't see everything there. I saw a red thing there for a second. Did I upset a mine or pass it? We're just going to go up the top and check out whether there's anything up here. Before we head down. It's a good view of our ship right there. Very nice. Okay. Yeah, there's a way in up th there as well. So that will be worth checking out. Uh, there's some fibre there, which is actually a useful thing. And caseless, and you are an assassin's drumbeat. You look kind of cool. I keep trying to use the laser weapons because I'm all specced into laser weapons. But I'll be honest, I'm just not finding them as good as that Beowulf. I just like that one more. I don't know why. Okay, anything? Not really. Not a vast amount here. A couple of books. Yeah. Dracula. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is it Dickens? Dickens was the name I was looking for before. It's Dickens books. Every Many of the books are Dickens books and 
we got to find books that aren't Dickens, particularly for that lady. Okay, so that seems to be that area cleared out. So now we need to go down again. Okay, so we're down. Is that another bloody mine? It is. I'm not getting sucked in, you see? I'm learning, I'm learning. Slowly but surely, I'm learning. So I'm going to guess she's not going to be in here because there's a mine there. You would think she would have cleared the mine unless she laid it. Am I somehow facing the wrong way? Okay, novice, nice and easy. Okay, not a vast amount of value there. Um, another, ooh, permanently increase your tool grip. Weapons damage by an additional 2%. I'll take it. 2% weapons damage is 2% weapons damage and not to be sniffed at. All right, so that just leaves the main mine ahead of us to go down through. And we'll just have a quick check around here for more mines at the entrance to the mine. Because some people might mine a mine. Who wouldn't mine a mine? Okay. Uh, and there's a, a panic alarm. And deep cave. So in we go. Holy crap. Shelter. And there she is. Okay, okay. Don't he, come he's dead, closer. Dave. He's dead, Identify Dave. Identify yourself. Hey, Adria. I am seven foot dust bunny. I'm with Constellation. Uh, yeah, I'm with Constellation. Oh, Vlad sent me to find good. you. I suppose I should have guessed. It has been too long since I checked in. I'm just glad we found you unharmed, Andresia. Vladimir and I were worried. Andresia. You are the newest member, yes? Do they often send you to check up on other, more senior members? Always. I'm the bad man. Uh, looks like they might have had good reasons. Perhaps. I suspect Vladimir worried you might find me on the ground, instead of this one. We waste time. We should complete our mission and then we can talk. Okay, it's kind of dark. It seems my light doesn't work when we're in those. Okay. Well, always worth checking. Never know what you might find in their pockets. Indeed. So, have we got both of you now? This is going to be interesting. Nice get up, though. You have a nice outfit, lady. Don't mind me ogling a second just checking you out there. Well, uh, you know, lubricant. Subtle hint. No. Um, okay, we'll grab the good stuff. And computer, there seems to be some bad guys up ahead. So update friend foe status, yes, let's uh, make them the current user. And uh, activate the units. Good times. Because it seems there's a couple, there's a couple of bad men up there. And uh, I need to have a couple of sneak attacks, don't I? So let's uh, let's pop this guy. Oh, he's already dead, Dave. Why is the industrial robot running away? Bloody, how much use was he? I ain't actually got a sneak attack. Hang on. No, no, don't worry, he's, he's dead. Oh no, he's not dead. Hang on. Hang on. He's not quite dead. Hello? Ooh. That's it. You, you, you keep him suppressed, sir. I'll deal with this guy. Uh, that was a grenade. I'm hoping he can't throw it that far. 
Oh, you go invisible. You are a stealth lady. I'm with you. Okay, don't worry, don't worry. It's under control. It's all under control. Yeah, I'm coming. There's like two guys down there. Can I please get shot in and then I'll deal with it? There you go. One down. I mean, with the two of them there, they just crowd everything off. And you can't do a freaking thing. Hello, I'll take that gun. And you, sir, I'll take your fire grenades and bits and bobs. Anything else you've got for me? Apparently not. I can't remember how this cave goes, because is this cave identical on the inside? It looks to be. Yeah, because that looks very similar to what was inside the other one. And I'm sure there was like a shortcut route. Yeah, you could go like up in here. Hop through. See, you can jump on the pipe and go up through. So, is that storage? No, nope, sealant. Okay, I thought it was going to be locked then for a second, because sometimes when you can't loot things with the scanner up, they're How locked. How are you easing into things, Andresia? Is our mutual Ooh, acquaintance the gravity is, the is, transition to this new way of life is heavy. Yes, I would say that the proper adjustments are being made. Uh, I, don't, I think I need a boost pack. Acclimating to what you perceive as the more um, insignificant customs. Interesting. Uh, Such no. as? I can't get it. You know, I need a boost pack. Oh, yes. Here's a particularly strange one. After right. a person sneezes, someone invariably invokes the phrase, Bless you. Oddly yes. Strange to administer absolution after witnessing your bodily function. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm sure there was a perfectly good reason that expression <laughs> was connected to sneezing. But maybe... Yes, anyway, I do have a point. And I don't know where to put said point. And I do n believe I'm going to want to go up one of these things. Do I want a boost pack training? Which would help solve this immediate problem. But I think I'm doing fine on the ground. I'm more concerned about actually being able to blow things up. And I'm not gonna go any further in security because this master lockpick thing seems useless so I need to go up so I think I'm gonna go ballistics and then at least I can start doing like energy weapons and then from there for from there for we can do other things like boosting up damage sys damage systems here so let's start by that one. So ballistic ship weapons have 10% increased damage and 20% less cost to use in targeting. So this means targeting might be a useful thing to have in the future. Okay, I need to go down to get the bits down the bottom. Oh, gang culture. I'll take it. And oh, uh, fairly disappointing bits down the bottom. They're chatting away down there. I'd be interested to know what they're chatting away about, but um, I want to actually get on with things, you know. I don't want to stand there and listen to them witter to each other all day long. Maybe they'll come up here and, sh uh, and let me earwig their conversation. Right, uh, what we got? Some wine and some bits which were probably blown off the poor guy's body. Uh, corner coachman. Another Orion and a jumpsuit. Yeah, fair enough. Nothing particularly exciting here. Assassin's Grendel. Right, and I think that's this area cleared for the most part. So we need to move on. Um, Best not to leave anything useful behind. Well, or anything whatsoever is my policy. 
generally if it's not nailed down I will certainly take it so don't you worry about that Adria your new name by the way heat leech getting rid of the bloody heat leech I freaking hate those things they freak me out uh, oh hello What's this? Oh, another AA rifle. Nice. More med packs. More. Is it Bodicea? It's pretty good. Veteran deep core calibrated space helmet. Mag pressure tank. I actually needed a mag pressure tank for some research, actually. I should see if I've got enough of those now. I mean, I can probably make them. But, you know, it's nicer to get them for free, isn't it? Alright, uh, I'm sure I should probably go into sneak mode now. I mean, I'll be honest, like I say, not really a sneaky, sneaky character. Come then, meet your friend. Oh. Once again, <laughs> we are did, did, did one of his guys just shoot him? Because I'm pretty sure one of his guys just shot him. Oh. Quiet. I should reload. Did you hear that? Yes, I heard that. How you did you hear that? Is our mutual acquaintance helping with the transition to this new way of life for you? Uh, yes. Oh, look, they're having the same conversation again. So this goes around that way, which will let me get to where that guy was. And there's a whole big area down there, which, yeah, this is all very familiar. Let's go and just pick this guy's stuff up while we can. Hello. And now we have this guy. Um, oh, that's not the best throw in the world. Um, this might be a good moment for the Orion because the Orion actually shoots quite a long way. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what. Ow. That is quite a lot of fire coming this way. You gals distract them a second. Can I? I am getting roasted here. But, um... Are you throwing a grenade? Right, one down at least. Ow, bloody hell. Alright, that was another one down. And you must be the big bad guy. I like the fact she's got the stealth the stealth gear. Oh, look, I need to sort myself out because I am getting cooked. You're not okay, we're you. down. We're, we're, we're good. Right. How are we doing on meds after we're hammering through the meds there? I should have used the boat, like, the boat here because it's high damage resistance. I should be making more use of that. I've still got 30 med packs. That's fine. And I've got a bunch of trauma packs as well. I'll use a trauma pack now. I'll eat the snake, the, the, the carbonara and that one. And we'll be fine. Okay. There's still one guy around here somewhere. I just saw Flash up there. Okay. Question is what they're talking about now. Okay, there's a guy around here somewhere. Oh, there he is, there he is. I see him. Don't worry, don't worry. Just let him stand up so I can shoot him in the head. Okay, or in the, or in the butt, apparently. There you go. 
There's no way he was actually getting that throw on me. Okay, there we go. And we can start picking locks. Oh, 1,200 credits. Nice. Digipick sealant. So we get a Digipick back. Another bit of spacesuit. How are you easing into things, Andreja? Is our mutual acquaintance helping? Are you guys going to have the same conversation again and again all the way down? Yes, I would say Because that if that's the case... Let us talk more once our mission is complete. Okay, fine. Yes. Look. Glad to haul whatever you... You stop the waffle, carry my crap. Which I got to just look here. I think this is the bit that goes round. Yeah, this goes round to the where we could have come up before. So you could have come round and sort of flanked it this way. It doesn't actually make a vast amount of difference. And I would actually say that it might be easier coming from that side. I'm not sure. Hang on, we do, we need to go down over there. I've got, I've got turned around. Okay, so here we are, we're getting down to the, the area now. Bloody dark again in this cave, as freaking always. I don't think there's anything left down here to worry about. Those two are having the same com conversation again. Which is lovely. Let's see what we've got here. Oh, this is... Oh, no, it didn't want to open. It is a modified Beowulf. Okay. I still want to modify the one I've got a bit more. And see if I can boost up its strength. Because... I'll tell you what, that gun is freaking awesome. Now, I'm guessing the artifact may be down there because I remember that section from before there was you know some rock formations and stuff down there but obviously the place I was going before wasn't supposed to have an artifact no the artifact is supposed to be up ahead so that is something yeah just cut out a bit of the looting and running around here just really to save on a bit of boredom from the running around and also it's so dark down here. And there was a lot of bits you probably didn't really need to see. 5,000 credits. Lovely. That is some nice credits right there. Okay. So that must take us up well over 300,000 now. Uh, no, just in 300,000. So we're good. 300,000. Right, so we are heading down here to the artifact. This is probably going to be dark and it's probably going to involve some mining of goodies as we come down here to the artifact. Oh, this is an artifact very much like the one on... Um, yeah, this stuff is, is useful. Yeah, this one is very much like the one at the original start of the game. Nice. So I'm going to go around and mine this stuff before we dig the artifact out. Okay, so I think we're ready to cut the artifact out. And I couldn't help but notice that um, the mineral forms in these lovely, interesting uh, gashes here. And I was thinking to um, ask the other two whether, um, hmm, whether I could check if there were any more gashes with interesting minerals formed into them um, sorry did you hear that um, yes moving swiftly on we shall um, grab the artifact I guess and we're heading back across the universe again is it me, or does this little ball in the middle look more complete this time? Whoa, that one seemed a bit longer. You did not respond when I called to you after you pulled out the artifact. Does that mean Barrett's theory and experience were correct? The artifact grants the first person who touches it a vision? Um, I don't know if it's the first person. Um. But, uh, possibly. 
I've not been able to make much sense. That it has though. happened to both you and Barrett is already more than we had before. I think it is important that we discuss what you saw back there. That man. What I had done. What? That you shot him? It was either you or him, was, right? Yes. I appreciate that you see it that way. I mean, the couple A of clips to kill him off. Outlook, not one I find is shared amongst members of Constellation. May I ask what your background is? Uh, well, yeah, I, I'm a miner and explorer. Argos. I have heard of this company. Small, reckless. Interesting. I do not have experience with this profession, but I have my own experiences with... risk. We both seem to be unusual additions to Constellation. Well, Please, I would ask that you not mention to Vladimir the, the circumstances in which you found me. This is not the first time that Varun Zealots have attempted to corner me. If it is known that this has happened again, well, it has been a while since I was given an assignment on my own. I would not want it to be even longer in the future. Do you understand? I understand, but I mean, look, it's fine. I don't really have a problem. I didn't realize they were even ruined zealots. I thought they were ecliptics, but, um, you know, look, let's be honest. The only thing I'm really a bit concerned about is how many times you capped him after he was down. Such a waste of ammo. Um, they've come after you before. Yes. It would seem they have not yet learned how much it will cost them. But then that is their fundamental problem, is it not? An inability to see anything other than the path which they have created for themselves. Well, that's true. And, uh, yeah, look, I'm not going to say anything. I, I, I sell a bit of contraband on the quiet here and this there. This means we are in agreement. Thank you. That is good to know. I will finish here and return to New Atlantis when I can. You should go now, as they will be expecting us. I mean, Sarah basically did say to me, and get up to basically whatever I like, as long as I don't bring trouble to Constellation's door. So, you know, as far as I'm concerned, that means you want to cap the guy three, four times extra, you, you, you do that. As long as you're paying for the ammo, it's not a problem to me. All right, I think that is it done here. Um, we still have a quest, though, oddly, to... Do we still need to go to the other planet? We still need to go to the other planet. So I guess next time we'll be heading across to Pav 4C. Oh, Piazzi, Piazzi 4C, sorry. Um, I'm going from there. So I'm going to make my way back to the ship and probably offload myself and Sarah and try and discover why I can't move forwards. And with that, I'll say thank you very much for watching. Like and subscribe as always. And join me again next time as we go to Piazza 4C.